Hey guys. All right. So what I wanted to show you today is the nutrition plan for our gratitude yoga challenge. Um, I'm going to go back to this other tab and show you where I got it. So this is, you know, the on demand page. I clicked on the three week yoga retreat. So you go teambeachbody.com. Um, if you haven't created your free membership, obviously you need to do that. Um, if you already tried your first workout, you know how to get here. So you click on on demand, you click on the yoga retreat, and then over here on the side is a couple of these awesome resources. And this one is the nutrition guide. And I wanted to show you a couple things. So this is, um, you can also find the calendar. So I guess I should show you this too. So this is week one. Um, the take 10 that I showed you yesterday, I just realized now is our weekends. Um, and then we've got week two, same thing on the weekends one rest day and one, um, or is that a relaxed workout? Maybe that's a relaxed workout. I didn't see that one. Let me see if that is a relaxed workout. Oh, day six, relax. Oh, okay. So your Saturday is the relaxed workout. All right. And then take 10 on Sundays. If you choose to do those, it's totally up to you. So that is the calendar. That's the schedule for the three weeks. This is the nutrition guide, and look how amazing it is, you guys. This is all just eating clean, natural, no processed. A lot of these recipes are easy ingredients that aren't super pricey, that are easy to put together. So um, what you'll want to do first is look at kind of which plan you're on. Um, based on how much you weigh would determine how much food you need. I really like to focus on eating five meals a day. I think it's so much better than just having breakfast, lunch, and dinner. We need to fuel our body even in between our meals because what happens is if we're going like, I don't know, five, six hours in between our meals, our body is going to actually start to store up fat because it's not sure when you're going to feed it again. Um, and so by putting snacks in between breakfast and lunch and lunch and dinner, your body is going to realize that you're constantly going to give it nutrients, that you're constantly going to feed it, and that it doesn't have to store up as much fat as it is used to. Um, so here are some tips that just can help you during this challenge. Um, here's some information on Shakeology. If you guys want to try Shakeology, um, reach out to me or the coach that invited you. I love Shakeology. It is more than just a protein drink. It has 70 different superfoods, um, nine different servings of fruits and vegetables just in this one glass. It is awesome. So we can either send you a free packet free to try, or you can try it for seven days. You can even try it for a month and be able to have it during this challenge. So you can really work on your nutrition and your fitness with the yoga and then the mindset, everything with the gratitude challenges. So seriously, there's like 50 recipes in here for you. It's amazing. It's incredible. This is even stuff that, you know, my kids will eat. So anyway, tons of breakfast, lunch, and dinner recipes. And I want to scroll down to show you something really cool that I just found out as I was looking at this. If you take before and after pictures during this challenge, so one right now, for a year before and one in three weeks for your after and turn them in to Beachbody to the challenge, they will send you this cool bracelet that says breathe. And on the back it says three week yoga retreat. How cool is that? I love free things. So anyway, I guess you'll enter at freeyogabracelet.com. Um, so anyway, that's just kind of a cool little mental note. So make sure that you take your before picture and you can, um, Compare at the end, and especially if we're paying attention to our nutrition while we're doing our yoga workouts, you're going to tighten, you're going to firm, you're going to lose some fat, you're just, you're going to be feeling amazing. So anyway, I think that was everything I wanted to show you. So pay attention to the calendar, print it out, follow the, you know, daily workouts, get um, a shopping list together for your meal plans so that you are prepared a lot of you that I talked to said, you know, I'm, I'm excited to do the workouts, but I'm really falling behind on my nutrition and rated themselves at like a three or a five. Some of you are more like a seven and an eight, but a lot of times we just need some guidance or we just need resources or we need ideas. So that's what this nutrition guide is really for is just to give you extra ideas and extra, you know, breakfast, lunch, and dinner ideas for you and your family. It doesn't mean you have to follow it to a T if you don't want to. Um, but just extra ideas.
extra things to throw into your schedule. So anyway, you don't have to print it out if you don't want to, but know that it's there as a resource for you. Okay. All right. Well, I hope you guys are having an awesome day. I hope you have enjoyed the workout and our gratitude challenge so far. And just make sure that you're checking in as often as you can. Um, all right. So why don't you, this is kind of cool. Why don't you comment below if you've seen all this and you'll get five points for just watching this video and tell me what you think about um, the nutrition plan. If you think that it will be helpful for you. All right, guys, I will talk to you later.